Welcome back and as we move on to the receiver on the Realistic TRC 1003 single channel 50 milliwatt hand portable the first thing to do according to the service manual is to set the frequency of the receiver crystal now when the crystal controlled like this you have to set the receive crystal separately to the transmit crystal whereas on a synthesized radio the synthesizer is producing the transmit and receive frequencies itself so you only have the one adjustment usually so on this radio the procedure is to have a frequency counter connected to an RF probe which is exactly what we've got this is the IF subsystem the MC3357 um, chip we put the probe onto pin 2 and then we adjust T2 transformer 2 is that one there until we get 27 decimal 33625 now this is 27 decimal 33640 so I've now dropped that and that's correct so now we'll put the signal generator on This is a single conversion receiver. I'm just looking what the limit specification is supposed to be for these. It's actually 2 microvolts, so that's pretty deaf by today's standards. But we'll see what we get. And what we're going to do is adjust transformer 1. I'm going to skip backwards and forwards between the pages on this. Transformer 1 is that one there. So that we will now do. What I now what I really need to do is to connect my um, loudspeaker in, um, to the um, to the radio. So I'll just pause the video while I find a way to do that. Right, so what it is, it's test point two. Test point two. It's just there, and I now have that connected through this little jumper lead to the um, audio input of the radio test set. So now we're going to adjust transformer 1. I'm using a Synad meter and the oscilloscope for the best uh, performance. Drop the signal down. There we go, that's set for best possible performance. And the only other adjustment on the receiver is the detector. Now don't be tempted to, we need to put a large signal on, like I just have done, the signal generator is now on uh, quite a hefty signal. But because test point 2 is in parallel with the internal speaker, you're going to have an impedance mismatch. You keep the volume low, because you don't want to damage the audio amplifier uh, on the radio. So we're now going to go for transformer 3. I'll just switch the other camera back on again. And then we can see that waveform. There we go. If I get my head out of the way. There we go. So I'm now going to adjust the detector, which is transformer 3. In fact, I'll use the yellow tool. Tiny little bit was gained there. So there we go, that's now set. And that's all there is to the receiver. You've got the one adjustment, the frequency adjustment, the detector. With it being single conversion, it's very simple. Now we've got to do a sensitivity check. So we'll just put that back. And what is the sensitivity? Well, I say the manual says it's got to be at least two microvolts. So we will set that to two. And that's two. And that's one. Just about here it's at point eight. 
So that's well exceeding what the service manual says. So that's it, realistic 1003, 50 milliwatt, semi-toy handheld. Just disconnect it from the equipment. And that's ready to be put back into use as soon as I've put back the antenna onto the correct pin there. I hope you found that interesting. Thank you.